hello this is Nick from ReviewOutlaw.com today I'm going to show you how to upgrade from the iPhone 6 which I have here plugged into my computer uh, over to the iPhone 6s um, so there's a specific process you want to do to make sure you don't lose any contacts any favorites um, bookmarks uh, music things like that the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to plug in your old phone you're going to want to plug it into the computer and make sure you're on the latest version of iTunes. Um, and you're going to basically want to do a full backup. Uh, that backup will contain pretty much all your music, um, all your app data, uh, or as much as it can save. Some things will get lost, like for example, Google Authenticator. That unfortunately will not transfer over. So uh, keep that in mind. You want to keep your old phone. Don't wipe your old phone right away. Keep that thing. Um, in case you need to copy over some settings that maybe didn't transfer over. But we'll copy over about 95%. Another thing you don't want to do is you do not want to use the iCloud to backup and restore. I tried that, did not work. <laughs> uh, pretty much mo all the music doesn't move over. That data does for the most part, but it's extremely slow and this is just so much faster and it's not worth trying to, to do the iCloud uh, backup and restore. So this is what I definitely recommend. So I'm going to take you step by step. First step is to back up and then we'll go to the next step. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to make sure both phones are off. We're going to swap the SIMs. We've just finished the backup. Backup is complete. So we're going to turn, this one's already off. You can see it's not waking up. I click here. My old one, you can hold down this one and this one, hold those down until it says slide power off. Interesting question. Cool. And then we shut it down. Now we're going to take a, take a paper clip here. Let me see if I can show you this. Yeah, just okay, popping this out, pushing the paper, paper clip in. It's not popping out. There it is. So uh, we get your SIM card here. This is the new one. I take the new one here, pop the SIM card out on here. There we go. And then don't get the two confused. You take the new SIM card, put that away. You get your old SIM card, put that in the new slot on the new phone. Slide that right in. Oh. Okay, so now we have the phone, new phone booted up, and it's asking us to set it up. So let's just go through that. Connect to there. After that, we're just going to basically plug it in, connect it to iTunes, and you're going to want to just restore. Um, depending on how much music and things like that you have on there, it's going to take a while. I'm going to set that up later. And you set up a pin. Fortunately, now they require six numbers. A little bit of a pain uh, versus the other way before, you could just do four. All right, here we go. So now I had tried before the iCloud backup. Again, don't recommend it. It takes forever, it takes too long, and doesn't get all the information you need. iTunes backup is the best way to go. Uh, if you wanna start fresh, have a new iPhone's a good way to go too. Um, you know, it'll actually be faster and longer battery life because uh, all the apps you have in there that you probably don't use uh, won't be draining it anymore. Okay, so here in iTunes, you can see that we have a backup today when I just made. So we're going to hit the restore, continue, and on the phone it says connect it to iTunes. So I'm just going to agree to all this stuff. Okay, continue on that. And then we're going to do the restore. Like I said, it can take up to about an hour on this. Um, but, uh, 
there's really no other faster way. So if you have any questions, um, and if you, if you have any concerns, if you like the video, please comment uh, below. Interested to hear what you think about the new iPhone 6S. Uh, if you like the video, please give me a thumbs up. Really appreciate uh, you watching the video. Have a great day. Thanks.